Hey guys, I wanted to uh, create a quick video on how to show you how to search the number of trucks in an area and the number of loads in the area. So when it is in your favor and you guys can negotiate the best rates, you guys will be in, an, you want to be in an area where there are more loads to trucks. So I'm going to show you real quick. Uh, you set up your load search. Uh, St. Louis is an area we like to go to because it always seems that there's a need for trucks in St. Louis. So uh, what I've done is I've gone on here and I've created a search. You want to create van, any van, the area you're at, leave the destination blank. Today's date, the deadhead I usually like to do 100 miles. Uh, you can do full, partial, or both. And then I would just leave this blank and you want to search two hours back. So we're going to search. And then we're going to look here. We've got 684 exact matches. So there's 684 loads out of St. Louis area within 100 miles on today's date, full and partial. And then that have been posted within the last two hours. So if you look here, uh, there's all kinds of uh, freight out of St. Louis. I mean, look at, look at some of these. Um, 505 miles for 1800 bucks that's a pretty good load right there that would be but the broker isn't any good but so let's uh up here you know there's lots of 900 miles for three thousand dollars um so there's a lot of good freight out of st louis so anyway now what i want to do is go back to that you search here you go back here to search trucks so this is going to show you what trucks are posted in your area so you want to create the same search so we're going to search trucks vans any vans out of st louis leave the destination blank today's date with the same amount of miles so let's say 100 miles full or partial or both and then search so you've got 93 exact matches so you've got 93 trucks and you've got 775 loads now that right then and there is going to tell you that your negotiation you have full power and this is going to be one of them days you kind of wait you know you start waiting until 12 1 2 o'clock to book a load you're going to get a really really good rate now let's go to a shitty area um and i've we've been here and i've told daniel i said we would never go back and that's that nashua new, new hampshire so we're going to look there i've got my search any van in nashua today's date within 100 miles We've got 316 exact matches. Now the great thing about freight is it does, it changes daily. So one day it could be in your, it could be good, the next day it could be completely horrible. Um, so then we're gonna go to search trucks. And I'm gonna create the same search there for search trucks. Any van, Nashua, within today's date, 100 miles, full or partial or both, within two hours. And we're going to see 142 exact matches. So really, you're at like a two loads to one truck. And that that is too, for me, it, it means it's going to be tougher to get a load. You're going to be able to get a load, but you're not going to get any good, great rates. So if you go on, you log in in the morning, you see there's 142 posted trucks, and there's only 300 some uh, loads, then you probably need to just pick something and go and get to a different area. <clears throat> but what I what we like to do is let's say we're in the shoe and we want to get the hell out of there and we're going to deadhead find an area around there and do the same thing and see and then you're like okay look I'm going to head over to Pennsylvania or wherever to try to get a load out but I just want to kind of give you that information and then also on here um, you can see what the lane usually averages so you can come on here to Hazelwood run that seat look at this one and it'll tell you what the broker spot rate what the average is uh, for that lane. So um, I just want to give you guys that little bit of piece of information, but that will help you no matter where you're at, where you're looking to book loads, that'll help you better gauge your negotiation. If you know that the loads to truck ratio is in your favor, then you've got the power to, um, to negotiate. So any questions, let me know. Hope this helps.